be an updated um, what I eat video because people are asking me about what I'm eating on my um, bikini boot camp diet workout plan. Um, so I'm just going to open up my refrigerator and show you. This is the top shelf where I keep most of my liquids. First off, you can see um, I've got a ton of water. I've also got water stocked over here and some up there as well. Obviously, water is really, really important um, in losing weight. Not just losing weight and staying healthy, but just overall, it's good for your skin and it just helps your body work. Your body's 70% water, so you need water. So I've got tons of water. Um, <clears throat> I also have some of these muscle milks, which is going to help me get the protein I need in um, when I'm tired or I don't feel like eating a big uh, meal with protein or, you know, I'm just busy. Um, I've got more water in my Brita filter. I've got my wine. If you're going to drink alcohol when you're trying to lose weight or you're trying to stay healthy, wine is the least caloric option um, and the less sweet, the less calories. So I've got a Chardonnay here. I love my wine. Um, I've got some thin cut beef right here. I'm going to cook this tonight and use it on a salad. Um, in this level right here, I've got my eggs, um, my vegetables, some of my vegetables. I cut up tomatoes at the beginning of the week because I use them in salads, on sandwiches, um, in dishes that I cook. So it's just easier for me to just cut them all up. Uh, lettuce, but I like the baby spinach lettuce. It's just really, really high in nutrients, and um, it tastes pretty good, I think. This is my fruit. I like to just buy the pre-made fruit platters. It's easier for me, and um, it's perfect for when I just want to get up and go and have fruit for breakfast or as a snack. But I try not to um, really dip it in the the um, dip in the middle because that's got a ton of sugar in it but I mean it doesn't hurt if you dunk it once or twice just don't drown your fruit in it um, turkey bacon obviously I eat turkey bacon for breakfast I use it to season my green beans carrots um, garlic sweet potato apple um, I've got some more potatoes in here this is cookie dough this has been in here for a long time it probably shouldn't be in there, but every now and then when I get a sweet tooth, I like to take a scoop out and just eat it. Um, you're not supposed to eat raw cookie dough, so <laughs> I don't advise anyone to do that, but I'm a cookie dough fiend. Just to get my fix, I get a little small spoonful and make it do what it do. Okay, so this last level is, um, this is what I had for lunch today. Um, an open-faced tuna salad sandwich with... Um, carrots baby carrots and hummus so I had some left over so I just keep it in here like that I made a big old thing of tuna salad to last me for the whole week for lunch um, this is really good it's high in protein and if you make it right it's low in calories I make it um I make it just with tuna low-fat mayonnaise sweet relish and I season it really good and it's really good and it's got you know a lot of nutrients and it's just low in calories um, hummus I live and die by hummus. This is roasted red pepper hummus. I got the biggest one because I go through hummus so quick. I like to eat it with my baby carrots. Um, so I have that. And then this is some cooking cream I got over the weekend. I was going to cook with it, but I ended up not doing it. So I don't know when this will get eaten now that I'm trying to eat healthier. Um, just some more vegetables I've cut up, some onions. This is bread. I try and get whole grain bread, and this is actually double fiber um, wheat. It has no artificial preservatives, colors or flavors, no high fructose corn syrup. It has omega-3, and you get five grams of fiber per slice. Guacamole, I absolutely love this, dipping my tortilla chips in it. Um, back there, I've got some chicken broth that I'm gonna use in a soup, and I like to cook my brown rice in it. Down here is vegetables, um, some cucumbers. I really like to cut cucumbers up, put a little bit of Italian dressing on them and eat them raw. Um, onions, bell peppers, onions. Obviously I just eat those and use them for seasoning as well. Um, and here's potatoes and cabbage. 
have a lot of frozen vegetables and meat. Um, I love frozen vegetables because I can just throw them in the skillet and make any kind of stir fry. It's really filling and it's on calories. I've um, got some fish, a few lean cuisines when I'm on the go and I don't have time to make a good lunch or a good meal. I don't really try and make a habit of eating those since they have a lot of sodium in them, but when I'm rushing, it's a better option than fast food. I've got some dried apricots. I love these. Um, some skinny cow candy. Those are really good too for when you have a sweet tooth. Um, these honey almond flax granola bars are really good. It doesn't have any high fructose corn syrup in it. Um, and it's got almonds and it's actually pretty good. It's only 140 calories and it's all natural. My brown rice and that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it for, you know, what I'm eating on my plan. I'm trying to eat a lot of protein, a lot of vegetables, whole grains, fruit, um, drink lots of water. And that's pretty much it. So I hope this gave you guys a good idea of the type of foods that I eat. If you have any questions, comment below. And as always, stay tuned for my next video.